On April 17, 1975, Khmer Rouge took over Phnom Penh and said that the Americans were going to bomb the city and that everybody must flee. In 1976, the Khmer Rouge transferred these people to the Banabang province, never to see their families again. People were separated into groups of hundreds, and in one group, only 24 survived. In 1978, Vietnam liberated Cambodia. Many of these captives fled to the Thai border in search of the UN. During the Khmer Rouge rule, over 20% of Cambodia's population was killed. Like over 50 million indigenous peoples in the Americas, the Armenian Genocide, the deportation of the Acadians in 1755, Japanese internment camps in Canada and the US during the Second World War, Rwanda in 1994, the displacement of the Tamils, Crips, and Bloods. This just is. On April 2nd, armed police surrounded a Seracolo Farms factory while border guards rounded up all the workers in the dining hall. The permanent residents and citizens were separated from the rest and let go. Everyone else was shackled on a bus for up to eight hours and then driven to a detention center in Toronto. In other news... In the early morning of Wednesday, May 27th, Immigration enforcement swarmed Lakeside Produce, arresting nine migrant workers, all women, one of whom was pregnant. They were all being detained in Windsor County Jail. How can I sleep if I'm afraid to wake up? They say, go home. Go back to your country. I don't have a home. I don't know where my country is. How can I sleep with the memories I keep? How can I bring my people's story to the light when they need the safety of the darkness? Never equality, only economy. Never equality, only economy. So, how long you worked here for? Oh, the quiet one, eh? How about you? About three months. And you over there? Almost a year. Oh, wow. You got a family? I don't know anymore. What about you over here? Two kids. My husband's dead. I send my condolences. Well, I've been trying to save money to feed my family. Mm, at least you have one. Wish I could feed my family. Side, long story, just put pressure on this. The boss is coming. Just be quiet, the boss is coming. Be quiet, the boss is coming. I hear someone screaming. Screaming? Yes. Probably a mouse, you know? <laughs> mouse. <laughs> the mouse doesn't scream like that. <laughs> what are you screaming? No boss, no. Why are you working like that? Working like what? What happened to your hand? Nothing. My hand. Oh my God! Blood. I'm. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I cut my myself. I just bought them. I'm sorry. I, I just, cut myself. I'm going to call somebody. I don't know if she'll even be back.
Do you see anything? Yeah, McDonald's. Pay attention! Right. So what'd you do last night? Same old, you know, cold beer, watch wrestling, nothing much. What about you? Actually, last night I got a call about an old case I was working on. I told those idiots I'm special ops whoa, now. Whoa. And... Do you see that? See what? What? Blonde. Looks like she's bleeding. Pass that. Hold this. She's a blonde Russian. Blonde, blonde, blonde. Olga. Olga, why Olga. is she bleeding? Why is she bleeding? How am I supposed to go? Don't get smart with me! Oh, today is her lucky day. Oh, oh, man. Where are you going? I'm going home. Don't have to go home. I have my bad days too, you know? But I, I thought I just lost my job. Don't worry about your job. Look, you need me, I don't need you. you. You mean I can get my job back? Yeah, but you have to pay a price for that. Why don't you just come with me? But I can get my job back? Ah, uh, yeah, you can. Just come with me. Nah, I'll get your job back, everything. <laughs> what about my hand? Okay, we have all we need. Send in the rain squad! And the men! Rain squad, rain squad, come on! All those who are enemies of the nation, get down now, that's all of you! Down now! Everybody down on the down. ground! Everybody down! Hands behind your back, we need a visual wall document! Oh God, now! Don't talk to me! Don't talk to me! I'm Canadian, I'm Canadian! No. No. He's safe! You! Up! Everybody up! up. Line up! I'm taking my what marker. are you still sitting down for? What is this? Uh -huh. Oh, why are you guys taking my water? Up! Line up! All of you are going down to Idaho. Most of you will be deported out of Canada. Follow me. Let's go! Did you forget to watch my country? Shut up! What do you mean? Dozens of migrant workers were arrested, restrained, and bused to the center on Thursday. A series of raids targeted a number of homes and businesses. It's the result of a three-month probe into illegal immigration by the Canadian Border Services Agency. The detainees are mostly farm and factory workers. A number of the foreign nationals worked at Saracola Farms in Bradford, which had two facilities raided. Saracola Farms is not facing any charges as a result of this raid.